a regenerative diet for weak bones and joints. Are your bones and joints sore at the end of the day? Do your knees hurt when going upstairs? Is this discomfort more intense when it's cold out or at night? Then you know your problem is the same as 20 of the population, arthritis, erosion, or even osteoporosis. What to do? First, mentally prepare yourself. Joint problems are not easily resolved. You should change some of your habits and be consistent with the steps that we will show you below. With them and a proper medical treatment, you will have a better quality of life. What is the best diet to improve the state of your weak bones and joints? In order to improve the state of your bones and joints, you should follow two very specific tips. A depurative diet, start your homemade treatment by eliminating the toxins that harm your cells, make your tissues sick, and weaken your system so that they age. This accumulation of harmful elements weakens cartilage, for example, and also makes you lose more bone mass. You know that carbonated beverages or foods rich in fats cause a loss in that essential calcium for strengthening bones or teeth. So, the first step is to start a proper depurative diet. A regenerative diet. What is the purpose of following a regenerative diet? Getting nutrients, essential enzymes to rebuild cartilage and thus boosting cellular regeneration. Tissues free of toxins, rich in minerals and good vitamins will allow you to have a stronger and firmer joint system. A depurative diet for bones and joints. It's best to do this depurative diet in the mornings. You will have foods rich in vitamins and minerals, which are great to start the day. They are rich, healthy, and above all, great for eliminating toxins, preventing fluid retention, and fighting constipation. Take a look. Suggestions for breakfast. On an empty stomach, start the day with a glass of warm water with lemon. You will also have another amazing remedy to cleanse and optimize the functions of the liver. What is it? A tablespoon of olive oil and a few drops of lemon juice. You can alternate both options throughout the week. A cup of 15 grapes and two slices of pineapple. Green tea. Bolto tea. A cup of strawberries and kiwi. Peach juice. Almond milk. Prickly pear juice and orange juice. This combination is as healthy as it is amazing. It will give you many nutrients as well as properly cleanse your body. How to make it? Very easy. You will need a medium sized prickly pear leaf. First, boil it in 200 milliliters of water until it is tender. Then, take the juice from two oranges and put it in the blender with a prickly pear in the glass of water that you use to boil. Try to get a well blended juice. If the flavor is a little strong, you can accompany it with a little bit of honey. A cup of oats with a green apple. Suggestions for lunch. Steamed broccoli. 
Carrots with brown rice. Baked eggplant. Whole wheat avocado. Mustard, and tomato sandwich. Coleslaw with cucumber, pineapple, spinach, and pumpkin seeds. Beet juice with apples and a garlic omelet. Lettuce, pineapple, raw broccoli, avocado, and almond salad. A regenerative diet for bones and joints. You can follow the regenerative diet at dinner or lunch. The purpose is simple, you will regenerate cartilage by nourishing cartilage with a base of essential foods to strengthen your bones and joints. We will explain how to achieve this. Lentils. Baked cod with tomato. Garbanzo beans. Carrot cool. Chicken breast with lemon. Hard boiled eggs. Stuffed tomatoes with turkey. Rye bread with garlic or onion omelette. Baked salmon with lemon and pepper sauce. Sardines. Jello. Jello is great for rebuilding cartilage. Lastly, we want to remind you that, just like we need to improve our diet by including depurative and nutritious foods, it is also essential to improve your lifestyle habits. Avoid carbonated beverages and industrial and pre-cooked foods. Try to drink more fluids throughout the day and increase your consumption of fruits rich in vitamin C. Exercise should be moderate. If you have bone and joint problems, intense exercise can sometimes cause more problems and benefits, so it's best to follow the simple steps. Going for a walk in the morning and to the pool three times a week is definitely the best for these cases. Be careful with the medication you usually take to relieve joint pain. Anti-inflammatories tend to seriously harm the liver's health, so try to combine them with natural remedies. A ginger infusion always has good results and is great. Follow these simple tips and improve your quality of life with them today.